Hey guys, Tommy from Hunt's Family Homestead. A little different down here <laughs> in the south this week. Monday, hmm, President's Day. We're off anyway, but as you can see back behind me and everywhere else, we got four inches of sleet. Y'all stay tuned. There's going to be some fun stuff in this video. All right, go to the valley of the house right there. See what I'm talking about the valley? Right here. Ah! Holy cow. I feel like an Eskimo. A who? An Eskimo. <laughs> oh, that's so creepy. This stuff is so heavy, y'all. We've got to get it off. It's like the valley of the house up there. I don't know what the uh I don't know what the load range rating is. But let's see if I can get you to that. The what? Nah, hey, it don't work that way. No, it does not. It don't work that way. Let's go around to the front of the house. I need to check it. It what? Eating the ice again. Our dog, our mountain cur is eating the ice. Oh me. Few inches later. Oh, sorry, y'all. <laughs> Valley of the house there. I know it's kind of hard to see it, but it's piling up in that valley. I'm gonna have to make an extension to get up there and get that. I think our barn is gonna be all right. Temperatures dropped from it was about 20. Yeah, I know you can't see me. That's all right. I'm uh, look better on radio anyway. This is documentation also for insurance. Just in case. Like I said, we still got We've still got four, four more hours of this to deal with. I know freezing rain's bad, snow's bad. Snow's, I mean snow, we can deal with snow even in the south. But this sleet, it gets so heavy that even the awnings on some of the businesses around town, they will actually cave in. We've got a 412 pitch on our house. So I think, I think it'll be all right. I think it will. What is she doing? Good job. Running and... Or a mountain cur there. Do you think the pole came in? Uh, the liner on it may break. I hope not. I just thought about that. Yeah. And by the way, we're not going to edit a lot of this. This is going to be a quick YouTube video just to show you what we had going on. Here is what we do not get in Mississippi. Yeah, what we do not get in Mississippi. Our hoop house, I mean, so far it's holding up good. 
I went in this morning and got most of the it was freezing rain actually yesterday afternoon last night and I got most of that off but then it started again this morning freezing rain and it uh it mounted up on the top I was warm in here you're warm in here we've got our heater and everything going in here We've got a few plants here and there. It's about 55 degrees in here. I got one space heater and then an oil type heater. It really works good. But you can tell, I mean, see, that's frozen solid. See that? I don't want to put it too hard. The condensation inside here is even frozen. Well, it's not now, it was this morning. Anyway, Woo. yeah, I can handle this a little better. Grayson said I didn't fall asleep. I told you you fell asleep last night. Oh, me. I have much of an appreciation for Northern people. Now. I'm telling you, that's what I told him. I said, look, we'll pray for them every night. <laughs> I, know, I know how bad it's been up there, but. You know, we don't get this down here. The last one that we got down here was maybe 85, something of that nature. And it, it was this bad. and Well, it was actually worse than this. You're going to stay in the hoop house? <laughs> Let's go check her right quick while we're, while we're out. Like I said, we're not going to be out here long. That sleep, when it hits you in the eyeball, it hurts. Mom said, "Don't look up." <laughs> yeah, I figured that out. Oh. I put that blue tarp up over there because of, that's the east side. There's not a lot of wind really gets into that. Let's go check our. There's Bruno. It's kind of dark in here. I know it is. You probably can't see him really well. Let's see. Come here, buddy. Where'd you go? Yeah, I know. It's dark. <laughs> Can't see. I don't have a lot of light in the barn. There's our... Our one that is with child. Very, very much with child. Hello, Lilo. He has a fit if we we're over here looking at her, talking to her. Just sit tight, buddy. You don't need to go anywhere. All right. Get a little bit of light on him anyway or something. I'm sorry, y'all. This is just raw. Oh, my bad. Hang on. There he is. That is our Nigerian dwarf. But, hello. He is a good guy. He is. No, he's just. He is. He's a crackhead. <laughs> Are we gonna put in the video of him drinking? Huh? Are we gonna put in the video of him drinking? She's uh. I don't know. If she's just nervous. Oh no. So she do any day. Pretty much. Bruno. GoPro to sign into my phone, well, but it, it was won't. Signed into mine. Oh, it's signed into yours. Yeah. Well, if it's signed into yours, look at. Look, there you go. Look at it, please. And y'all, by the way, uh, I'm not worried about my hair. This is this is the. Uh, <laughs> this is how it bees sometimes. It is what it is. It is what it is. But. Uh, I don't get to show her very much. This is our daughter, uh, Lindy. She's 18. I did the vlog. Yeah, she did the vlog. She, uh, there's a, let's see, there's one coming out when? Possibly Tuesday or Thursday. T Tuesday or Thursday, anyway. Then there'll be another one on this. <coughs> but, and then uh, Cameron's got one coming too. And our son, his son, they're actually in Gulfport, Mississippi. And they're 350 miles away from us for right now. 
Uh, they were gone down. They were they were gone down. <laughs> they had taken a trip down to the new aquarium in Gulfport, and we're going to come back today. Of course, that's not going to happen because we've got sleet uh, all the way south, even below Hattiesburg, Mississippi, which is very close to the coast. And then you got Jackson, the Meridian, through there. Uh, it is nasty. They're getting freezing rain down there. Uh, Gulfport is supposed to have. Like I said, we're filming this on Monday, uh, President's Day. So they're supposed to get, uh, I don't think they're supposed to get thunderstorms. They're supposed to get <laughs> heavy rain. And then tonight in Gulfport, Mississippi, it's supposed to be 19 degrees. Here where we are in Northeast Mississippi, it's supposed to be seven. I ain't never experienced that before, so I don't know what that feels like. <laughs> now y'all, she does talk better than that, but that was just a Southern slang. I don't talk better than that. <laughs> Oh, Lordy mercy. All right. We're going to go back out of the barn and go back up to the house and try to get some of the sleet off the top of it. I'm not going to film a lot of that because it's just it's just too gnarly. I'll be honest with you. It's just cold. Y'all know how it is. But uh, y'all see what we've got going on here. Uh, I know there's uh, people that I've talked to from Minnesota to Nevada uh, to Virginia to Texas all over that is experiencing a lot of this stuff. And it's not fun. It's not fun. But uh, I will tell you this. There are better days ahead. Um, very soon, better days ahead. And if, I usually don't do this on my vlogs and things like that. But um, if you're struggling right now, hey, put your trust in Christ. That's who we are. That's the reason we get through what we get through, the times that we need to get through things. Um, we trust in Him and everything that we do. Hey, this is Tommy, and let's try this again. This is Tommy and Lindy for Month's Family Homestead. Y'all have a blessed and wonderful day, and hey, stay cool. No, don't we'll stay cool. Stay warm. Stay bundled up. God bless y'all. I told you.